Hello guys and welcome back. I'm Ken, this is Buff, and we are back with part two of the Obsessive Compulsive Cleaners where some people with OCD come to clean a haunted house. This super haunted house that's being haunted by this old lady. <laughs> <laughs> welcome! <laughs> Check her pulse. <laughs> Check her pulse! <laughs> that wants them to clean it with nothing. I hate things that make rooms smell nice. Do I look like a kind of lady that likes things that smell nice? <laughs> Look at my hands! And I eat mac and cheese every day. <laughs> cheese mac and cheese. <laughs> she lives off of it. I live on cheese pastas every day of the week. Which we all know she's not. She's she's haunting. She's haunting this place. <laughs> she doesn't eat the mac and cheese. She came with the house. We're back. Be nice to give Plastag a spring clean. Long as no one breaks anything or moves anything out of the wrong place. As long as no one moves anything or breaks anything. <laughs> Meanwhile, like all those ladybugs are in a pile of, they're like, ah! <laughs> They've been tortured. <laughs> get, get us out! Both Haley and Dan checked into a local hotel. They failed to sleep over at Plazteg, with the conditions proving too much. She really vacuuming she the is, mattress? She is vacuuming the mattress. <laughs> but also, I thought they were going to stay in the haunted house! I'm what? so disappointed right now. Oh, yeah. We're, we're staying here for five days. Just kidding. We're not. We're not staying here. The whole get out of here, guys. Wait, wait, you said it's the most haunted place. Never mind. Oh, <laughs> uh, we're gonna we're gonna hit the hotel up. <laughs> you think we have a death wish? We're out of here. <laughs> we're back tomorrow. There's no way I would have stayed last night. I couldn't have. And then we found the dead mouse, obviously, and that was just, you know, a dead mouse. That was it. <laughs> she. Well, how long that mouse had been there? Oh, she probably had it for breakfast. She's not eating. <laughs> she's not eating mac and cheese. Mouse and cheese. <laughs> mouse and cheese. <laughs> Watch this. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> hey, you're gonna watch this. It's <laughs> <laughs> like, whoa, whoa, my dust, dude. What are you doing? I've been collecting that. <laughs> All the dead skin of my ancestors. Are just flying. <laughs> I'm breathing them in. They're gonna become boogers. Uh. Surprised the other girl with the vacuum cleaner didn't like start in the air, you know? Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Ghost busting it. But I like a bit of dust because yeah. the house is old. Preferring to use a dustpan and brush. She just uses a dustpan and brush. She, I like how she keeps saying, I prefer a little dust, you know? People live here. Make it dusty. People. <laughs> well, who, yeah, who, who lives here? They lived there, right? With the past tense. Yeah. And they still haunt it today. <laughs> These carpets have been vacuumed twice in 29 years. She doesn't own a vacuum cleaner though, so I wonder who did it. That's true. That was the last crew that came in. Yeah, never to be seen. <laughs> Some say they still haunt the brought halls. Their, <laughs> brought their fairy juice. <laughs> the pipe yeah. uses this because it's gentle and his lovely red carpet. But he doesn't have to do the hoovering, does he? Yeah, I didn't, they, they, they hooked this vacuum cleaner up. I didn't even think about this place actually having electricity. <laughs> I think they just have the windows open. Oh yeah. Frankenstein's down there like, hey! <laughs> that's my juice. <laughs> well, girl's got like stuff all stuck in her hair here. She's oh, missing yeah. some hair back there. That's where she had the accident. That's where like, you know, yeah. you know, whenever like you see how the ghost died. That's you know, right. You know. That's when she went down. Yeah, yeah. Mm, unfortunately. She uses this 1,400 pound vacuum cleaner on her carpets five times a day. Did she say 1,400 pound... <laughs> She's the strongest lady I've ever seen in my life. 1400 pound vacuum cleaner. <laughs> uh, She's just out there just whipping around like it ain't nothing. Yeah. <laughs> Easy. Oh <God>. Flex. <laughs> it's the, it's the you know it's the current. <laughs> He's fighting the ghost. Oh. <laughs> Stop stopping me! I will clean! I will clean this! <laughs> God, yeah, imagine what they're breathing in right now. He's like, uh, he wipes it. He's like, look. It's not even like dust. It's like, look at this hair. Look <laughs> at <laughs> this living creature I just wiped off of this. Your face is gone sooty as well. After two hours of vacuuming. Oh, the girl, don't talk about his face being sooty. This is fake tan. <laughs> oh, blow. Yeah, that's rude. Look at that, Dan. <laughs> I just don't want to use my hoover anymore because I feel like it's going to break. I don't feel like I should use my vacuum cleaner anymore because it's doing its job and I feel like it just, it can't handle that. <laughs> I can't lose my baby. <laughs> oh, uh, oh, God. I've been dismantled. Uh, 
so much work <laughs> vacuuming. Ah. <laughs> Date on it is oh February two thousand and ten. So five years out of date. Oh, don't open it! Oh. <laughs> of course, he's gonna open the five-year-old mayonnaise with like all like the dead ants hanging to it. Like, ah! <laughs> he just unleashed the mayonnaise demon. <laughs> what is this in the background? He's got like a whole bunch of like plastic crawfish. What, what is that? I don't know. The hot peppers. So that's a. Uh, is that peppers? I don't know. But let's not take away from the fact that he just opened up that jar of mayonnaise. Oh yeah, it's only five years old. Bloop. Oh yeah, <laughs> <laughs> aged. <laughs> Why? Yeah. And, 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 Why? I know. <gasps> what did you think was? <laughs> we think we think it smells like. <laughs> oh god! It's like a uh, it's like a jackass episode from back in the day. You do you want me to drink it? Yeah. <laughs> How do people live like this? Upstairs, haley has been cleaning the bathroom for two hours. <laughs> Demon's on the chicken and chicken about. <laughs> I can't believe this. He's like, me, the girl, dang. <laughs> I ain't seen nobody clean like that in 29 years. <laughs> oh, it's dripping all over my face. That fungus falling all over me. Instead of helping. Oh my God, this moldy stuff is dripping on me. If only I just cleaned it first and then it would be like, Water. <laughs> ah, I'm just squeezing my head. Let me <laughs> <laughs> Dandelions are everywhere. I must spend at least four hours a day. Yes, must gather the herbs <laughs> for the meal. I'll <laughs> <laughs> be fine in a stew. <laughs> I love my mac and cheese. <laughs> oh, I just wanted to check if we can use a product. No, impossible to use a product. Impossible. It's impossible. No, do not ask me again. <laughs> when Asma, her voice got really like, no, no, mortal, <laughs> you shall not. No, I told you, bleach no is my bleach. <laughs> bleach is my secret weakness. <laughs> and I'm a bit of a loss as to what I can do to help you. Why don't you just read a nice book? Read a nice book. <laughs> then you'll be happy. <laughs> Just go read a book. Just be happy, girl. Like, you're feeling down? <laughs> just get happy. Duh. Yeah. You feeling poor? Just get rich. Whatever. It's fine. <laughs> I don't get it. Kids just these stop days. Stop feeling like that. <laughs> feelings? Uh, I'm 300 years old. We don't talk about feelings. <laughs> it won't matter much longer, dear. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. But I so desperately want to help her that I'm willing to put myself in this unbearable situation. Feels so bad for her. This is so hard. God, you guys don't know what I'm going through right now. Oh, I have to do this for her. It's for her. Look at this freaking awesome room they're in, though. It's yeah, pretty cool. They, they got they... that one statue up there, fist bumping. <laughs> like, yeah, what's up, what's yeah, up yeah. dog? Yeah. 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 <laughs> 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 Cornelia looks like a person who would give you a poisoned apple. <laughs> I'm so American. I heard 1,400 pound vacuum and thought, there's no way it's that heavy. <laughs> Even the comments knew. <laughs> okay, well, let's see what else happens. How many people does she have in this house at a time? One. I think she's a hoarder. <laughs> They're just talking trash about yeah, her. They are. I think she's a hoarder. Well, I, I don't think she's added anything to the place. I think she's bought it all. She might just. You know, hoard all the bugs and stuff that <laughs> died in there. But like, what is up with that picture on the bottom left? It, well, the one that looks like it's like like got a big blood stain. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was about I was about to say something about these pictures, like the Harry Potter pictures, like move when you go past them. <laughs> this one's like, yeah, that guy's about to come out and get us. Coming to help, or are we just here as your servants? I like it to look like an old place. That, you know, it's 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 a kitchen. Like <laughs> she's like she's like it's it's a kitchen. It's supposed it's to what it's supposed to look like. It's supposed like. to have mac and cheese all in the microwave without For never twenty cleaning. years. Never cleaned that. <laughs> they're they're cleaning right now, right? Well, I'm just gonna lay back just like I used to in the good old days. Ah, <laughs> let me just relax here. Get to work. You know, with all my collections of things, and she's probably moving them or anything. I mean, I I don't like it at all. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. She's about to get him. Oh, no. They, they may be right about her being a hoarder. Uh, she's like, oh, I, got, I brought them over here to clean, and now they're cleaning, <laughs> moving my things. <laughs> I don't like it at all. <sighs> ponder, ponder, ponder. <laughs> 
I'm going to call my friends. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to raise a little hell. <laughs> yeah, I was just cleaning off all the um, cobwebs and... Yeah. <laughs> you could see for a second how she was like... But then she was like, hey, hello, everybody. Yeah. <laughs> You're not cleaning my cobwebs, are you? <laughs> uh, <laughs> I put them there 29 years ago. <laughs> How am I supposed to catch the flies now? We need your assistance. We need to know what we can move. Oh, no, I don't want it, anything moved. No, it's got to go exactly where it was. <laughs> You're going to help us clean? She's like, help you clean? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I've never cleaned, except I say I have, but I haven't. <laughs> Now put everything back where you got it. You can't come and start putting things where you want them mm. when it's my house. I mean, what right do you think that you have? What right? Whoa! What right do you think you have to come in here and move things? Ah! To clean them. She did deliberately say leave them exactly where yeah, they are. Yeah, yeah, she did tell them. And now she's like, you have incurred the wrath of 300 <laughs> years. <laughs> That's it. Germs attack them! <laughs> Rise up, my minions! The ghost monsters, the, the, the all the dust starts collecting. Get it back to as it was. Okay. Honestly. <laughs> I gotta oh. go. I must prepare the spells. Yeah. It's <laughs> like over here. Wait to the fairy liquid. <laughs> 300 years old, I don't have time for this. <laughs> okay, all right. Well, you know, whoo, uh, man. Well, they're uh, definitely gonna die. Yeah, yeah, that, that, that's, yeah, that was a little bit of foreshadowing there. Yeah. They're, they're done. Mm. Anyone I know would feel the same as I do. Would you have someone come and move all the old things in your kitchen? Let me tell you about this. Everyone I know that still haunts this house, <laughs> everyone I know that haunts this house does not want their things moved. <laughs> Ask the Sphinx back there. Yeah. Sphinx, tell them. <laughs> oh, woman, this is my house, me. Then why don't you clean it? You think it's okay to change the way I live? Literally, all we did was move the toasters. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. Close friend and local historian Mark has come to see the house's cleaner image. Is there a close friend Mark here? Like 20 year old Mark? They don't know each other. <laughs> this lady and that dude are good friends? Hey, yeah, I guess. All right. So, this, I think this is after it's been cleaned. It kind of okay. it kind of just skips from here, so I don't know. Layered in decades of dust, it's now been vacuumed. The furniture polished. Did they turn the light on? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just, uh, <laughs> the first picture is like the gray, like drowned out version. It's like let's turn up the saturation, and it looks better. Yay, we cleaned it. <laughs> so look at the colors. Yeah, probably only about a hundred years old. It's no, it's not a good one, but it was. She said earlier that the carpet. Like when the girl's vacuuming, the, like that carpet didn't even look that good when she, when she bought, bought it. it. And yeah. she's only been there for 29 years. And then years. she's over there talking about how this carpet, it's like 100 years old or something. Yeah, she's definitely hot in this place, <laughs> all right? This lady's definitely a ghost. Yeah. Wow, this looks really good. Oh, wow, this looks really good. <laughs> uh, <laughs> looks really lovely, actually. I can't wait to eat from here. Okay, this guy, he, he might be like a ghoul or something. Like, he's, yeah. he's possessed right now. I can't wait to eat here. <laughs> I also can't wait to use the toilet and, like, you know, rub some what, what? paint. <laughs> some paint. That's just lube, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta keep a bucket of it, you know, when you're 300 years old, you think it work as well as it used to. <laughs> It's now been scrubbed clean with soap, and the boiler has been fixed. Cornelia can wash in her 19th century bath as much or as little as she wants. That's <laughs> because so I say, like, yeah. oh, they fix it, and it's like, it's like as much or as little or. as she wants, you know. <laughs> it's like, ah, oh, yeah, she's, that soap's going to just turn to like a puddle eventually, because she's, <laughs> she's not going to touch it. It's going to be, this, this is like the old soap bar right here. Yeah. <laughs> Since it's all been... Lavishly clean. Do you think you'll ever get in it? No, I haven't so. got time to have baths. I ain't got time for baths or, or running water or bleach. You I still know, don't have time for a bath. I'll melt. See, <laughs> uh. maybe she is a dust monster, and like she, she could, she gets wet. She's like, <laughs> <laughs> that's why she has to go outside and collect herself when she goes and uh... <laughs> we put the straw back in here. You know? <laughs> I think deep down she is very happy. She's up like moving things back. This, uh, what, this bread was living in the crock pot. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't even cooked yet. <laughs> it's, it's, it, was it was just, just a bunch of yeast. <laughs> <laughs> 
I'd really like people to kind of come here and potentially look at Plastec as a wedding venue. We definitely consider something. They want to make it a wedding venue so that she can have some income and not use it to clean anything. Imagine how doomed your wedding has to be. <laughs> To go get married at the most haunted place yeah. in Wales. <laughs> they take like your wedding picture like in the background of the mirror. That lady's all like, <laughs> they've moved my stuff for their wedding decorations. <laughs> as a young bride, can you imagine anywhere better? Uh, Plus take as a backdrop. I mean, it's absolutely fantastic. I believe that dude. <laughs> like, I'm like 40 years old and I think this would be a great place to get married. <laughs> Whenever I finally find love. <laughs> Until I get my hair cut fixed, that's just not going to happen. My uh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my God, look at the turnout. We've got loads of people. Well, I feel like we've achieved the unachievable today. High five. They've done it. They've done it. They cleaned the three rooms in that house. That's right. They cleaned three rooms out of the 17. Got talks of people into coming and ha having cookies and... And apple demons. juice, <laughs> drinking the demon juice. The sacrifices have been gathered. Now it's time. Um, and I hope that you're pleased with what we've managed yeah, to do. Yeah, of course here. I am. You've done a good job. You really have. I'm so happy for you guys. Get out forever. <laughs> and if you feel like a weird weight on your shoulder, like have weird dreams and wake up in places where you don't remember going to sleep, don't worry about it. <laughs> it happens to everyone that comes yeah, to visit. Yeah. It'll go away once you're It's dead. on the house. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever you die, your spit will come back here, so we'll be friends forever. It's fine. It has massively helped me being here this week. So for example, I've used less bleach. Oh, good. I'm, I'm glad about that. I, I think, I feel like old girl that's talking is like kind of scared of her because she's kind of like, hiding behind yeah. the dude there. She's yeah. like, yeah, I'm real glad that we like came and uh, uh, <laughs> and didn't use bleach. Yeah, no bleach. Can I get out of here, please? Yes. Right. All right, then Cornelia. Thanks so much, Thank Cornelia. You. Bye. Bye. Just like straight face, like getting out of here. No yeah. like high five, no handshake, no hug or nothing. Like, see you, girl. All right, yeah. we're out of here. Bye-bye. If I can go a whole week with using a small amount of bleach, then I think I'm well on my way to... Okay, I just keep forgetting the show's actually about them. Like, it's like, I think I've taken something away from this other than ghosts, and I'm just oh. like... Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's cool, I guess. Yeah. Good luck with your bleach. Yeah, because you use less bleach. That really taught you something about yourself. Yeah, I've learned something about living in filth, even though <laughs> I, I didn't. I just kind of came in and cleaned a little bit. And, yeah. <laughs> Then probably the crew off the screen clean the I've rest of it. I learned that I could not live here for five days. <laughs> <laughs> not even one. They've made it much cleaner. I think weddings could be part of Plastic's future. I'll keep fighting the battle for this house. What battle is she fighting? Maybe she's fighting the demons trying to take the house over. Oh, is she trying to get rid of the demons? Maybe, maybe she's like the last... The la the only thing standing between them and like world domination. And she's oh my like, gosh. You don't move anything because it's all part of this intricate spell and thing she has going on here. That's true. Yeah. Just think. Just because they wanted to come in and clean, they could have let Cthulhu. They could let, they, they, well, it is 2020. Oh, maybe that's gosh. what happened. Maybe they actually did use a little bit of bleach. Oh, oh no. No. Oh. Cornelia didn't even say thank you to them. She didn't seem too impressed. She'll probably ruin it again. Yeah. She keeps saying she has no time to do anything. What is she doing? Saving the world. That's right. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Next project. Cornelia being cleaned by house cleaners. <laughs> uh. well, I feel like I've learned a lot about myself. You know. And, oh, 100%. And my, yeah. my relationship with dirt yep and i love bleach if you do too leave a like on the video and uh we'll see you guys next time <laughs> stay toasty happy birthday if it's your birthday and i love you <laughs>